Hello guys, welcome to my new video regarding psychotic distributed engine. This is part of my psychotic series. In this video I'm gonna introduce in psychotic secret server distributed engine and I also gonna install site connector using memory MQ. Let's start with it. Here is a diagram. We have psychotic secret server running on 192.168.2.243 the side connector memory MQ gonna be installed on this same machine distributed engine will be on a different ma machine 192.168.2.235 so all of them are in the same domain 51 sec test.dev this is our domain controller 192.168.2.12 if you want to know distributed engine how it working, this is a nice diagram. As you can see, the local network, we have secret server and the site connector. Both of them can install on the same server. And on the remote side, distributed engine gonna talk back to site connector to fetch a message and send to result. Let's start work on this is my secret server. We go to admin, distributed engine. Um, of course, we need to enable it. So right now it's not enabled yet. So click edit. So there's no valid site connector. We need to have site connector first. Just do a new site connector. We're gonna use a memory MQ. There's a rapid MQ as well. Um, memory MQ make it installation much easier. So we're gonna do give a name site connector one MQ. We're gonna use in default settings such port and they're not using SSL to make it simple. So it shows connectivity hasn't been validated. That's fine. But we still can do download site connector installer. We create our site connector, but we didn't install site connect service yet. So we are pending to installation. Let's click that. Um, and Hoping it's been downloaded. Go to download folder. It's downloading right now. We download it twice. Let's um, just open this one and we can. Extract all to a folder. Right click setup file, long as administrator. The installation wizard has launched. Basically, it's going to run in a service. And we will be able to find it out from a service. You should have a psychotic service installed memory MQ site connector service running. Okay, perfect. So we verified psychotic memory MQ site connector has been installed. Now we can validate connectivity. Oh, 
validation succeeded. Let's go back to distributed engine. So we have side connector MQ and it's validated. We installed it, validated, and now we can enable our distribute engine. Um, it was grayed out, you were not able to check it since we installed the memory MQ side connector. It's valid for the check right now. Um, for those settings, um, you can leave it default. Um, you don't need to change anything, but if you really want to change the port number, um, just for example, you want to change default port to different one, then you can do that as well. But for me, we want, I don't, I don't like to change anything right now, so we can just enable it and save it. So after you saved it, you can see the engine installer 64-bit or 32-bit is available for you to download it. So we enabled distributed engine. Now we can download the engine installer 64-bit. We can go back to check our diagram again. So we have our psychotic secret server. We installed a side connector, memory MQ. Now we're gonna work on our distributed engine, which is on different server 192.168.2.235. We're gonna copy that engine installer to this server to install it. This is psychotic diagram for distributed engine, how the traffic flow looks like. Basically, um, you can install engine on remote side, which you can scale up your secret server installation. If you have multiple sites, if you have tons of servers to manage it, and then that and install another distributed engine will definitely help a lot. So distributed engine has been downloaded. It's a six four bit. We can uh, copy to the server one nine two one six eight dot two dot two three five. not a big file 24 megabyte what we can do is just right click on it run as administrator we can open service console and uh, we'll check it later. Okay, installation is fast, couple of seconds, then it's gonna be finish it. And then the installation widget disappeared after the installation completed. But we can check, always can go back to the service tab to check the psychotic service here, you will see psychotic distributed engine service has been installed. Distributed engine has been installed on 192.168.2.235. Then we can come back to our secret server. You will find their engines pending activation. So we can click manage new engines. You will see there's one engine here pending to be activate it. So we're gonna create a new site because it's a um, new engine installed on remote site. Click this check mark. Creating site for engine right now. 
because of my child license issue, I cannot create in a new site here. But the letter process, once you have done this part, you should be able to create in a new site. So that's pretty much everything I need to show you how to install a new engine, how to create in a new site connector, and eventually you need to create a new site. Of course, you need a new license for that. And my evaluation license will not cover this part. Thank you for watching. Thank <laughs> you.